Hello everyone, this is Charlie Cleveland and um, I just wanted to take a minute and talk about uh, some changes we're making to the Marine HUD. Uh, we posted this image earlier this week. This is a mock-up that Corey did and um, I, we, I worked with him to kind of redesign, redesign a little bit. We added this uh, mini-map in the upper right. You guys have been wanting that for a while and we kind of have been too. Um, you can't quite see that but we added a commander uh, indication up there along with uh, player res and team res. The team res is it's really hard to see that. I, I apologize. You'll see it in the video in the uh, in-game footage in a second better. But we wanted the team res to be visible for expert players but not for newbies so not to confuse them. So it's kind of faded out there. And then we have this the death messages and build messages in the upper left. And we thought that worked pretty well but then uh, we got some feedback from you guys in the forums, and actually somebody else made a mock-up that we actually liked better. They moved the mini-map into the upper left, and they put the, the uh, current location in the upper left. They moved the player res below it. We didn't like that so much, but we did like the mini-map part. And they added the game time, which um, we liked, though we didn't like the position. And um, we thought that there, there were some really good changes there, so this is what it looks like in-game now. I have to kind of ride, drive this one hand here, but you can see, let's see here. Yeah, okay, so you can see we have the mini map in the upper left now. We have the player res in the top with the, um, yeah, the commander. Let me see, you can see the mini map here. Actually looks really cool. Um, let's see if I can drive this like this. Yeah, I mean, I, we think that the mini map will really help a lot there because you can actually see, it's like easier for navigating the map and um, oops, this, these are some new changes to Summit that you're going to see in here. This is the new flight control. But um, yeah, so we think this is going to make a big difference in the game. Oops, ignore that bug. <laughs> That's a skybox problem. We're going to fix that before we release it. And um, yeah, so I just wanted to give you a, a quick look at those changes and how it evolved from our idea through the community and finally into code. So uh, hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you soon.